Hey, what's up, guys? It's Kazooie here, and welcome to episode 19 of Skin to Glory. And in this episode, we're gonna see if we are able to clinch promotion to Division 3. Because right now, we currently have 9 points, we need 16 points in order to promote, and we have 3 games left. That means we have to win at least 2 games and draw 1 in order to gain promotion. So um, it's gonna be tough if you compare it to the previous episode where we uh, had a really weird one, a lot of penalties against us. Played really bad in general, but still managed to win two games at the end of that episode. So hopefully we can do uh, better at least in this episode compared to the previous one. And uh, we start off great here against a decent Bundesliga team. A great goal there from Costa, making it 1-0. Then 33rd minute, a free kick again. Costa steps up for it. The free kick king shoots it into to make it 2-0. And um, I'm going to say it actually like Costa is actually one of my favorite players this year. After Neymar, he's my favorite five-star skiller in the game. And uh, you definitely have to try him out if you haven't already. Then uh, 45th minute, we stay very calm here with Perotti. A nice finish as well into the bottom corner, making it 3-0. And what a way to actually end off the first half. Then going into the second half, some great uh, skill moves there for my Asamoah. Almost making it 4-0 uh, as well with Perotti, who actually just scored. Unfortunately enough for us, we uh, we didn't do it. Then uh, we move on 63rd minute. Some great stuff here from Quadrado. We continue on with some more skill moves in between two defenders. Then a really nice finish as well into the bottom corner, making it 4-0. I can see from the replay that we actually panel this player whilst doing a fake Rabona. Beat two players at the same time really nicely. And then a tidy finish into the bottom corner. So a really nice goal actually to make it 4-0. Then a 72nd minute, a good save there from Perrin. Even though he hadn't really had to do much in this game. He actually performed really well, uh, surprisingly. My opponent did get himself another chance with Pischek, his right back, who uh, was up for it because of that corner. But again, a good save from Perrin. Afterwards, he tried to get a header in, which went wide. Then uh, in 87th minute, a good interception there from our centre-back, Tornelli. Plays it on through here to Parotti, who was open free. Stays calm, and I shoots it in as well to make it 5-0. And that is also how the game would end up. So uh, a lot of goals in this game. Which we obviously uh, obviously wanted because we had to win the game uh, in order to uh, promote. So uh, that's what we did. Picked up the first three points. So uh, a great way to start off this episode. Then uh, we picked up some more injuries here with Muriel. We also had to apply a contract there to uh, Quadrado. And uh, yeah, we switched teams and we move on what will be the second game of the episode. And uh, we come up against, again, a decent looking side. This time 3-5-2 formation Premier League team with Mares and also Wijnaldum and I think Mkhitaryan too out of position. So I wasn't really too sure what to expect from that. But um, yeah, it seems to me that playing players out of position works very, very well. Might even try it out at some point too, maybe like a winger or something at striker. But anyway, we start off this game uh, creating some, uh, some good chances. Unfortunately, the first one didn't go in. Then 20th minute, we do get a shot in here with Musona with his five-star weak foot, making it 1-0 in the game in our advantage. Then a 45th minute, he gets himself a chance here too with Mikitaran who completes the skies it. And that was about it for the first half. Continuing on here into the second half, a bit of 1-2 uh, passing here with Kovacic and also Parotti. An easy save there for Yoris. Second half, again, mainly us with the chances here. A shot here from uh, Ben Yedder where we do hit the crossbar. Then we get a header in with Vieto. A good uh, reflex there from Yoris as well to keep him into the game because it was only 1-0. And I just want to make the 2-0 that desperately. So I uh, went with a cross there, which we uh, miss. We get another shot in here with Ben Yedder where we hit the crossbar. And then from that, we hit the post as well uh, from the back of Yoris. So uh, very close making it 2-0. Unfortunately, that ended up being not the case. But still won the game, picked up the three points, which we needed that desperately. And um, now we're about to go in what will be the final game in this division. And also the final game of the episode. And we just have to at least get a point. Otherwise, we uh, we have to play this division over again, which I obviously don't want to. So, um, yeah, I decided to pick up an injury card because I wanted to play with this team that desperately since I just I just want to try up Muriel. Really like him this year as well. So, um, yeah, switch back to this side. And, um, yeah, move on will be the final game in the division also in this episode. And uh, we come against a La Liga side. 4-3-3 formation in form as a striker. So, um, yeah, strong team to, uh, to play against in this final game. And... Uh, I have to say it, we started off terribly. I, I don't know what happened. My goalkeeper got the ball. I tried to just clear it away randomly with B, but then he picks it up with Isco and yeah, made it 1-0. So just the worst possible start really to uh, to this final game. And uh, yeah, I was very nervous, I have to say, because I just didn't want to play the vision over again. It's just the worst thing. Uh, we got a chance with Muriel, which he uh, didn't really hit that properly. Went wide, very, very bad. 
the 40th minute the chance it with Quadrado with some great skill moves beats the defender there plays it off through to Muriel who taps it in and makes it 1-1 that's the shot we obviously want to see from uh, the striker then uh, we move it into the second half a 65th minute bit of 1-2 passing between Costa and Muriel a nice McGee spent to cut inside another 1-2 pass continue on with another 1-2 pass and it is Muriel to make it 2-1 Picks up his second goal of the game and uh, actually gives us the lead in this game as well. Then we move it in the 80th minute. There is uh, Parotti there on the wing. Uh, gets the ball there from Douglas Costa from a throw-in. Uh, we try to cross it in. We lose the ball. Then we pick it up here with Asamoa. We try to go for a shot and actually went in as well into the bottom court and making it 3-1 and actually securing the win in this game. A really nice way as well to, uh, to secure that three points because uh, we got the three points from this game even though we needed one. We got a win, and uh, that is obviously the best way to end off this episode. So, yeah, guys, that is pretty much going to be the end. Hope you enjoyed it. If you did, then make sure to leave a like. would be very much appreciated. So, thank you very much for watching, and I will see you guys later. Bye-bye.